After the freeze and thaw cycle of winter, roads open up. A small crack quickly becomes a pothole. Bent rims, flat tires, and if you hit a big one hard enough, you swear your car is going to be swallowed up in a crater. It's not only a combination of aggregate and asphalt, but what kind of rolling, what kind of density, what kind of thickness. So we are looking at all of those aspects. Rajib Malik is a professor of civil and environmental engineering at WPI. His specialty is road construction, and he's literally written the book on how to make better, smarter roads. Better performing longer lasting, more durable. The key to making roads with less potholes is to develop the perfect recipe, and it varies. So if you're in Florida uh, versus if you're in Maine, your asphalt binder will be of a different um, quality. To test for that perfect recipe, they cook the mixture to 300 degrees, then load it into a specially designed compressor that simulates a giant roller squeezing it to make a road. To test their theories in the lab, they have a variety of pieces of equipment, including this one, which actually simulates what it's like when a truck drives over a highway. This load simulator is one of only six in the U.S. By placing samples under the wheels, they've determined a fully loaded truck is 1,000 times more damaging to the road surface than a family car. A well-built highway requires nearly four feet of material. The top six to eight inches is the hot mix asphalt. Rule of thumb is that thicker the material, higher the density, better is the product. Their goal is to produce a 100% recycled road. This layer is entirely recycled. Our biggest problem in the Northeast, cold of winter freezes the water, expands it, and little cracks become large potholes. To test how well water stays out, this sample will be exposed to 5,000 cycles of forcing water in and out. If it shows signs of breakdown from water infiltration, the recipe goes back to the drawing board. Then you know that this mix has suffered moisture damage. So as you might suspect, maintenance is key. A little crack can lead to a bigger split if water gets inside, whether it's a super highway or your driveway. Seal it. That's the best way to do it. It is, but seal it with something that is, that right, is like that. It keeps the water off. I mean, because once the water gets in there and it freezes, get the cracks going on. Uh, really a fascinating lab that I did not know existed. No, that was really interesting. Yeah. Yeah. I have potholes all over my driveway. I mean, it's <laughs> not a long driveway, but it's, it's all wrecked. Sounds and... like you got to redo it. I know. I know the people who know what recipe to use for your Oh, good. Ways. We'll yeah. talk after. Yeah, we'll talk. I, we'll we'll talk. swap recipes. I'll give them something Greek, and maybe we can, you know, make a deal. No, oh, sounds good. I'm kidding. I'm kidding.